Hello everyone, hope you're doing good. Well, if your screen is flickering or tearing while playing games, this tutorial is for you. We are going to do some very simple steps yet very effective and it will be working on Windows 10 and Windows 11 both. So let's go ahead and fix it. So here in the start icon, just do a right click and then go to settings. Now at the left hand side, we need to select system and then we need to go to this display option. So you will find it uh, in Windows 10, the same process will remain same. Might be a little bit different, but you will find uh, the display under system itself. So the moment I click on that, here you have all the properties related display, where brightness, night light, HDR, please make sure that everything is, uh, you know, recommended here. So as far as the scale and layout is concerned, um, see if it's uh, asking me to select 125% as recommended I have done that and display resolution 19201080 that is also done display orientation obviously landscape and here we have this related settings advanced display display information and refresh rate so I'll click on that uh, here we have uh, the bit depth color format and we will click on this display adapter and from here you can see what exactly you have the reason why I'm here is to select the refresh rate so if you have a higher refresh rate you can select lower and if it's lower then you can select the higher just to ensure that screen flickering or tearing is fixed while playing games or doing anything in the computer all right once you are check once you have checked all these things just close it and here just do a right click in the start icon and go to device manager now once the device manager is opened here we need to go to this display adapters and you might be using Intel or AMD or uh, Nvidia graphics card you will find it under display adapters now once you have find it you just need to do a right click on that and then go to properties and the first thing which we will check here is the date of that driver so we will go to the driver section see the driver date so you can see i have a pretty latest uh, driver uh, not very much old but if you see anything like 2016 15 or 18 you should update it there might be a possibility that you're using a very old driver and it doesn't have a latest update on that but yes you can try to update the driver from the same window you can click on update driver and you can select search automatically for drivers and if it says the best driver is already installed you can see currently it is actually installing a latest driver in my computer so it says installing drivers and and if in your computer if it's not showing installing drivers then you can uh, click on update driver and then instead of selecting search automatically you can select browse my computer for drivers I'll let you know how we can do that so currently it's updating my drivers and for most of us if you have successfully selected the right driver or updated the graphics driver which I am doing it for most of us this will fix the problem the quality the FPS you know overall experience and look and feel will be better once you have a updated graphics driver no matter you're using Intel, Nvidia or any other. So you can see Windows has successfully updated your drivers and I'll click on close. So let's say if you do not see like that, then you need to do a right click, click on update and let me just see what exactly now the date is. Now earlier it was um, 21st of March or something, it is updated, that's fine. Uh, just do a right click on that driver go to update drivers and if you uh, click on search automatically for drivers and if you see the best driver is already installed just like this 
then you need to do a right click again and then go to update driver and select browse my computer for drivers now here you will select let me frick from the uh, list available and from here you can select the driver so you can see uh, here i have uh, 1338 you can try all these versions one by one see which one works for you all right so you can select the top one then click on next then second one then click on next see which one is better for you while playing games all right so once this is done you can you know restart the computer and enjoy your computer i hope you have enjoyed this very short video uh, please let me know in the comment section that which step has fixed your issue and please hit the like and subscribe i'll see you in the next tutorial have a wonderful day